their new adoptive mother paraded them on local television. Marlene, Sean, Chris, and Eric, Barbara's children. We were just fortunate the first time we went through to be able to get uh, three of one family and uh, three Indians. And we, were, we, were, we felt very fortunate. But the happy family image was a facade. Years later, all of the Gott children would tell horror stories of abuse. The beatings, the beatings were, uh, it was physical. I mean, just anything at hand, any, you know, whatever would hurt the child was done. Eric Gott is currently serving a sentence for manslaughter in a Louisiana penitentiary. For a while, I'd become a violent person, and I didn't realize it. The last couple of years, I've given it a lot of thought. And I think that's where a lot of my problems came from, being forced to live down here. The scenery, it's like, um, I don't have a concrete memory. It's more like experiencing a past life. At the age of 18, Marlene Gott began a long and difficult journey home to Manitoba. I wanted to be rescued my whole life. I wanted someone to come and get me. I wanted someone to... I wanted the family to come and rescue me and take me back home. <laughs> 